This is a story about a man named Boo. A poor Hawaiian dad never know what for do. Hard to believe it's been nearly 20 years since Bulaia began making people squirm, making nice ladies run in fear, making his own people look in the mirror. I want sovereignty. I don't know what it is. Throughout the 90s, Bulaia's TV show and comedy albums drew a line across the state, separating those who didn't like it or didn't get it. I went past it, Dennis and Lecture's not there. Dennis, call me up, you know my number? My full six. And the rest of us who couldn't stop laughing. Now fast forward a generation to a place where time stands still. What's up, everybody? Even without the hair and missing tooth, this is where I was born and raised. The voice is unmistakable. No mind the house, we never rake leave long time. I never rake leave long time. It's like my carpet half price. If you get one small refrigerator, look like you get plenty of food inside. <laughs> but don't be fooled. This is not Bula Ia. It's Kawi Hill, 45 years old, a father of four with another baby on the way. These days, he sells solar panels. Yeah, kind of a lizard guy. But most of all, he's a farmer. I stick it to a taro patch over here. Working the land that's fed his family for hundreds of years in Waikapu Valley. It's a fig tree. It's got water chestnuts. We get mangoes. Baga is all oh, no. Back to his roots, like a true Hollywood story. You gotta eat the lao lao. No eat the big neck burger. You rewind far enough and it starts from his days as a pro surfer. That's you. You know that, fella. <laughs> Back in the days. A few minor bits on a surf show led to his own show as the Hawaiian Superman. I just had my my wife, she just grabbed the high eight camera. Hey, get ready. Wow, what are we doing? Just, just point the camera. To one point I just started shooting myself. We can conquer the land and we can get back to Aina. Eat the low low. Hawaii. Raw and edgy. The anti-establishment hero began cashing in. Bought crazy bullet your money. Yeah, were you making a lot of money? Hell yeah, man. My first check of the CD, I never made it was almost 70 grand. After for my at Kobe Hill, $70,000. Oh! <laughs> then came his first run for governor in 1994. Hey, at age 28, he was too young. Tonight, for the first time publicly, Cowie Hill reveals who told him how to get on the ballot. I went to Is Israel, come out to people all his house. So we were talking to him all day. He said, hey, doesn't your brother look like you? I'm all, yeah. How old is he? He's 32. There you go. Using his brother's ID and a scribbled signature, he made it. I looked at the paper and it looked for governor. Ah, on the plane, I was like, who is that? That's like putting Mickey Mouse on the ballot, but if we pulled it off. Of course, Hill was later disqualified and almost got in big trouble. Ben Cayetano got really, really mad. They're gonna put me in jail for a fraud, because it sort of was. Life was getting complicated. Cue the music. How did this all come to be? It's crazy. And then the downfall, the personal demons, the run-ins with the law, Kaui Hill burned out. But he never gave up. And Boo never really went away. No! My boy! This is his new stuff. Never before seen until now. Talk to her. Approach her. Get to know her. He's older and wiser. Bill Clinton is now out of office and now we got Malama Obama. And perhaps even funnier. We love all the Hawaiians and Samoan Puerto Ricans. We love everybody. We go kill them with kite. <laughs> Damn it! Tell me that's not hilarious. Well, let's fall crack my head on fire. But I'm fucking hit hard. Every true Hollywood story ends with a comeback, and Hill says he's ready. With that voice of a generation, he isn't about to stay quiet. Bula E is a character in, in a lot of us, all of us, if you can get to the point. It's just be you. Just be yourself. Be you. So oh. 